Welcome back to UK Pro Reviewer. In today's video, we're going to talk about an incredible cloud storage platform called Nextcloud. If you're tired of relying on services like Google Drive or Microsoft OneDrive and want more control over your files, then you're in the right place. Let's dive in. Cloud storage services are convenient, but they come with a major drawback. You're entrusting your files to another company and hoping they handle them properly. That's where Nextcloud comes in. It's a free and open source cloud storage platform that you can host yourself, giving you full control over your data. Nextcloud offers a wide range of features that make it a powerful alternative to traditional cloud storage services. With Nextcloud, you can easily upload, sync, and share files with customizable links. Collaboration tools, such as file commenting and project organization, make it easy to work together with colleagues and friends. But that's not all. Nextcloud can be extended with various apps, including a photo viewer, video player, encryption tools, and more. If you need advanced collaboration features, Nextcloud Hub has you covered with audio and video conferencing, mail, calendars, antivirus, and even a built-in office system. The possibilities are endless. Now, let's talk about how you can run Nextcloud. There are a few options available. You can host the server on your own hardware, creating a private and secure setup. Another option is to choose a Nextcloud provider, which gives you online storage with varying capacities. And finally, you can sign up for a web hosting plan and install Nextcloud on your web space, which is what we'll focus on in this video. When it comes to web hosting, there are many providers to choose from. We recommend looking for plans that include Softaculous, an excellent auto-installer platform that supports Nextcloud. Hostinger is a great example, offering easy installation and even providing a refund deal through our exclusive partnership. Nextcloud system requirements are similar to other web applications, such as PHP, a MySQL or MariaDB database, and Apache or Nginx as the web server. This means you can install Nextcloud on a budget shared hosting plans without any issues. However, keep in mind that some providers have restrictions on storing large files or backups, so be sure to check their terms and conditions. Once you have Nextcloud up and running, you can access it through your web browser or use the free apps available for Windows, Mac, Android, iOS, and Linux. The browser interface provides a clean and user-friendly experience, allowing you to view, manage, and share your files effortlessly. The desktop and mobile apps offer syncing capabilities, making it easy to access your files on the go. One of Nextcloud's standout features is its powerful sharing and collaboration tools. You can create custom links to share files publicly or with specific individuals or groups. Options like password protection, link expiration, and permissions control give you full control over who can access and modify your shared files. It's a flexible and secure system for collaborating with colleagues or sharing files with friends and family. When it comes to performance, Nextcloud performs admirably. Uploading files is quick and seamless, and the syncing capabilities of the desktop and mobile apps work efficiently. However, depending on your hosting plan, you may encounter limitations in terms of file size or download speeds. It's essential to choose a hosting plan that suits your needs or consider upgrading to a plan that gives you more control over server settings, such as a VPS plan. This will ensure optimal performance and remove any limitations you may encounter. Nextcloud is an excellent choice if you're looking for a cloud storage platform that gives you full control over your data. With its easy installation, powerful features, and flexible sharing and collaboration tools, Nextcloud is a reliable alternative to mainstream cloud storage services. Whether you choose to self-host or opt for a web hosting plan, Nextcloud puts you in charge of your files. That's it for today's video. I hope you found this overview of Nextcloud helpful. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tech reviews and recommendations. As always, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.